Hi, this is Steve here at the new wheel. Uh, I've got a Kalkoff Sahel Compact. Uh, I'm going to show you how to adjust its Shimano Nexus 8-speed internally geared hub. Um, the cool thing about these hubs, um, they're really easy to use when you're riding the bike. Uh, you can shift through all the gears at once. Um, you can even shift when you're, when you're stopped at a light. Um, and most importantly, they're very easy to adjust by yourself at home. Um, what you're going to do when you're adjusting it is you're going to shift into your number four gear and you're going to look down here on the hub next to the chain. There is a yellow dot that is fixed and a yellow line that will move every time you shift a gear. And when you're in the fourth position, those two yellow marks should line up. And if they don't, whether it's on one side or the other, we're gonna use the barrel adjuster here to adjust the tension of the cable to line those markers up. And so what I'm seeing here is that the yellow line is a little bit further back this way, indicating to me that there's just not quite enough cable tension. If it was a little bit too far on the other side, that would mean that cable tension was too tight. I would have to bring it back a little bit. So since it's a little too loose, I'm gonna take the barrel adjuster here and I'm gonna turn it away from me. So I'm turning it in the counterclockwise direction here. And as I do that, I'm looking at that mark down there and that's gonna move just a little bit. And then I wanna check it and shift one gear down, one gear up and see if that lines up. And you can kind of adjust, make fine tune adjustments from there until that's just right on the mark there. So to recap, the most common adjustment that these internally geared hubs need is the cable is usually a little bit loose. So to adjust that, we're going to use the barrel adjuster here. And to tighten it, we're going to turn that counterclockwise or away from you. And you have to be in the fourth gear. And every time you make an adjustment, you need to shift. Just one click down, one click up, and check your adjustment. And then you can keep going from there.